Hi, and in this video we're going to be taking a first look at the TX-RZ720, the first THX certified AV receiver in our lineup. So, what does THX certification actually mean? Well, I'm going to go over a few of the basics for you right now. Now the TX-RZ720 has been given the THX Select certification, which means it's been designed to run up to 2000 cubic feet, which is 56.6 cubic meters. Another major part of the THX certification is the post-processing. Now in here we have re-equalization, timber or timbre matching, boundary gain compensation, and THX Loudness Plus. These can only be found in THX certified products and they help you get to what the director intended you to hear in your home cinema. You can also see on the back of the 720 it's fitted for wireless networking, either 5 or 2.4 gig. On the front panel of the 720 we have the setup mic, an auxiliary audio analog input and an HDMI input for mobile accessories or a temporary connection. The rest of the front panel has all the normal connections, input buttons, tone controls and listening modes along with a pure audio and a power on off. Now to start us off on the back of the receiver, there's a fixed hardwired ethernet connection which gives you access to all of the network streaming facilities available within the AVR and there's also a USB port if you want to connect a phone or a hard drive directly to it. There's six HDMI ins on the back and two main out. One can be selected as a sub or a zone two for multi-room video. All of the HDMI connections support up to 4K with HDR and Ultra HD. So there's absolutely no problem passing the absolute finest video signal through the AVR. As you would expect, we've got some legacy connections which will allow you to connect your analog video and audio. These are all assignable except for the phono input. There's also three digital inputs, two optical and one coaxial. And we can't forget the built-in AM FM tuner. Inside the TX-RZ720 there's 175 watts per channel across all 7 channels. This means you have many options from Dolby Atmos, DTS-X through to standard 5.1 with an active zone 2. And then lastly we've actually increased the facility on how you control the AV receiver. Now not only can you do IP control, you can do RS-232 and direct IR and there's also a 12 volt trigger which can be assignable to the main zone. And that just about covers the video on the first look at the TX-RZ720. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, please like and subscribe to the channel and I'll see you soon. Take care. Bye bye.